Hello everyone, my name is Crone and welcome to the first episode of Gnome Craft. Around me is a village which I found on Rochester Stream and I call it Crollville. And we have some pesky villains over here. They're just trying to get all the villagers, but I've set some barriers so that they cannot get in, but only play your scan. And right now, this is my starter base. I customized it a bit. The house was only this big, but I added this spot more, the two stories, and yes. Then I got some villagers. We got also a holy tree, which was generated by the seed with two bells. This whole spot hasn't been touched by me. The only things I have done is added this wall around me and improved my house as well. <clears throat> and that's mostly it. So yeah, so for this video, I'll do some mining probably, and also, I found a desert temple and a village outpost, which I will raid. Also, in the game with me is Regal Sense Bead, aka the the owner of this realm and also Chelwana. Yes. I'll start with the expedition. First I'll grab myself a bed just in case. And hopefully I don't die. I'll also leave the malt here. Yeah. I might not be ready for the villager outpost, but I'll literally at least try to destroy it or something. I'll just hope I don't get bad omen because that's gonna be really bad. Real bad. So, yeah. Right now. Ouch. Should be somewhere this way. Alright, I'll be back when I actually find the village. So yeah, it took me some time to actually find the village outpost. And I'm getting game pain by the skeleton. Ooh, a bow. And good du durability as well. But I don't have any arrows with me, which is gonna be really bad. First, I'm gonna try to kill this witch at least. Only sugar, yeah. So, there's the outpost, but that's not the only thing that there is here. I'll first go and check out the temple that I found, and then let's go raid this place. Alright, so here's the temple. Kind of into the ground, which kind of sucks. <laughs> but yeah, 
right, let's hop in. Ow. Okay, so. <laughs> do not touch this spot. We're gonna go on the side. Hopefully, we do not die from fall damage. We took zero damage. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna light this up. Oh. Before I open the chest, I'm gonna grab this. This is gonna come in handy someday. That there is inside. A feather falling and I'm breaking. I'll put that on boots. Did I get a golden apple, which is pretty nice? Some sand. I can find sand really easily. Then another golden apple. Some string. I'll take the bones as well. Then another book. I'm breaking and another golden apple. Here, golden horse arm, diamond horse armor, some more sand, and another book. Feather falling and multi shawan. Wow, that's some pretty neat stuff. Also, gonna grab this iron. So yeah, I don't want to lose all this stuff, so I'll just head to my base, I mean village, because I'm not risking of actually losing all this stuff that I found, especially the golden apples and the emerald and the books. So yeah, I'll be back when I back at my village give back all my stuff in the chest and i'll be back by the outpost all right so i'm back at the outpost i just got all oh god chill the flip down chill 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 let me explain what i'm doing Thank you. Anyways. Uh, I should have brought the golden apple because there's like 10 of them there. Wait. Is there a imprisoned golem? If there is, that's gonna save my life a lot. I'm just checking in third person. Does not look like it. Doesn't look like it. Ah, oh, god damn it. This really banged. Because this is gonna be hard a lot. Okay, some arrows. This is gonna be helpful a bit. Okay, I don't want to go on the very top, but I want those banners, so a stealth mission definitely won't work, wait, I have cobblestone I can build up. Please do not attack me, please do not. Jesus Christ. Yes, I'm begging Jesus for this. Alright, one banner. Oh, don't shoot me. Don't shoot there. Shoot me from there. There's a husk even here. I'm just trying to get all the banners. Should I YOLO in there? I think I'm gonna YOLO. I mean like I have three banners, but still. <sighs> 
YOLO. Oh, hello, Hoss. What are you doing here? Alright, I'm gonna clog the first floor so that no, no pillagers come, can come inside. Floor 2 safe. Ouch, ouch. No, 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 no. I do not want to pick a fight with you. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You stay out of here. You stay out of there. Okay. At least... Alright, at least that villager won't come over here. I mean, pillager. Excuse me. Alright. Anybody home? Nope. I'm just gonna grab all this loot. There's nothing in here. Dark oak, wood, logs. Oh, that's gonna be nice. And yeah. This place is basically mine. Alright, I'm going back to the village now. Sheesh. At least I didn't die off there. And good thing I didn't get bad omen. Because that'd be a catastrophe. Because I'm not even ready for a raid. I mean, I can barely... Okay, not barely, but I can at least... The minimum, I can like 1v1 a pillager. Not the whole raid. Or even a ravager. Or even one of those... Those wizard pillagers that some of those little bad angel thingies vex let's find those vex thingies but yeah for first adventure it was kind of successful in a way currently the best are coke clocks but now i'm gonna Put some of these banners up to show that this village isn't a place you want to raid because we will murder you in cold blood video. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It might be, might not be the best video, but I did try. So yeah, like the video, also subscribe if you're new, and stay tuned for more Gnome Craft videos. Bye!